Lauren Feldman, welcome to Monday Matters, sitting in bumper to bumper traffic edition. Politics. Trump had his city hall, his town hall. That went well, huh? People actually cheering that he sexually assaulted that woman. Unbelievable. CNN's a mess. They're owned by John Malone. He's a conservative. They're moving to be the new Fox. And it didn't go well. He's a lunatic. And it really shows. I mean, he's cracking up under the weight of all these indictments, I guess. In other political news, everyone's favorite insane congressman, George Santos, indicted 13 counts. He's saying it's a witch hunt. Everything's a witch hunt. When you're a bad guy, everything's a witch hunt. And it's amazing, the Republicans, he's still fit to serve, no problem. He'll be able to serve from prison. He'll be in prison and he'll still be a congressman. Unbelievable, just unbelievable. Ron DeSantis, he's going berserk in Florida still. His latest trick, outlawing Holocaust books. You can't be gay, black, trans, or Jewish in Florida anymore, which is kind of ironic considering so many gay, black, Jewish, trans people live in Florida. He's gonna get crushed by Trump. He's doing everything he can to be a bigger lunatic in the hopes that it helps, and it won't. It doesn't matter. Social media news, Blue Sky, what is Blue Sky? Blue Sky is a new Twitter competitor built by Jack Dorsey, the guy who built the first Twitter, and it's an exact clone. I mean, exact. The exact same website, minus the Nazis. Lots of people there, it's invite only. Not a million people yet, but there will be eventually. And the big discussion over there is how do you keep the Nazis out? How do you keep this website sane? And I don't really know how they're gonna do it. There's just too many Nazis in the world. You know what I'm saying? And it's a group of nice people at this point, and they're really, um, you know, they're really adamant about trying to keep these Nazis out of there, but I just don't know how you do it. I just don't know how you do it. Um, as I said, it's literally an exact Twitter clone. It looks like it, it acts like it. And eventually, I guess there's gonna be just Nazis there like there are everybody, you know, everywhere else. It doesn't matter. Media news, Vice went bankrupt. What is Vice? Vice started as a punk rock magazine by Nazi. Gavin McGinnis, they morphed into a media company. They had a deal with HBO, they had a website, raised billions of dollars, and the, uh, they just filed for bankruptcy. Soros, George Soros. George Soros bought them, or part of it, which is interesting. I don't know what they're gonna do with that thing. I don't know if the brand means anything anymore, you know? I just, I just don't think it means anything. I don't know what they're gonna do with it, but I guess they're gonna try and do something with it. Forbes, they're also out of business or bought by somebody. They haven't been good since Malcolm died. That's Steve Forbes, he ran it into the ground. I don't know who's been running it lately, but they're completely irrelevant other than the Forbes 400 list, which everybody loves. Everybody loves a list of billionaires, but I don't know. I guess they'll do something with that. Who knows? It doesn't matter. Lauren Feldman in traffic. Thanks for watching. LaurenFeldman.substack.com.